Hey guys, I'm Joey. Welcome back to another exciting episode of Over the Tables Random Reviews. If you're not subscribed yet, click the subscribe button down below, hit the notification bell. I've got a ton more videos coming out to you guys. You have no idea how many products I have to review. It's ridiculous. I got to get on it and you guys got to subscribe so you don't miss out. Now today's product, what we've got is like a mini, a very, very mini little meat cleaver knife with like a little sheath I think it comes with. I'm not 100% sure, it was literally like a dollar or two. I'll pop a link in the description if you wanna get your own. It seems really cool, we're gonna test out how sharp it is and how it looks, so let's open it up and check it out. All right guys, so we're gonna be using this karambit knife that I reviewed in another video. It's the last time you're gonna be seeing this karambit knife for a while because this is the new knife that I'm gonna be opening packages with right here. So say goodbye to the karambit knife. Anyway, let's go ahead and open this thing up comes in pretty standard eBay type packaging, which is uh, standard. So let's see what we got. All right. Well, it does come in some plastic. That's always good for protection from scratches and whatnot. Uh, very, very sticky little sticker. I guess that's why I call it a sticker. Why am I doing this? This is, this is, anyway. Well, I guess while I'm opening the package, I'm sure you guys know there's a lot going on in our country right now. And if you want to know my input, you're not going to get it. This is not politics. This is random reviews. Here it is. Look how tiny, 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 tiny this thing is. Compared to my hand, it's stupid small, guys. This is, it's got a cute little leather sheath on it. And a little, a little loopy, a little, little metal loop on there. So that way you can, uh, I guess, tie it onto a necklace if you really wanted to. I probably would if, if it were me and I am me last time I checked. So it's got a nice little button. It opened up kind of nicely. And here it is. It's kind, it's literally exactly what I said at the beginning of the video and exactly as it was advertised. It's a meat cleaver, but like super small. But somehow, even being that small, it fits nicely in the fingers. Like, the, I don't know, they just, it's just designed well. It's got a hole up there. Not sure what the hole's for. Um, and you could also tie it to something, you know, make something out of it. I don't know. I don't know what you guys do with these products. I just know that this is kind of cool because of how freaking small it is. This is one of the smallest knives I've ever seen, especially a meat cleaver. Pretty sure that's the type of knife it is. It's it's fat. It's a fat knife. It's a large... It's a large knife. So let's go ahead and see how sharp this is with the paper test. I've done it quite a few times, and you could tell in other reviews how sharp or not sharp a knife is by how it slices through paper. And I could tell you right now, it's not bad. It's not great. It's not great, but I've reviewed much worse than this. It's just so hard to get a, get a grip on this thing and just grip and rip. But it does slice through. You guys can see it is, uh, it's getting pretty clean slices. It's not bad. It's gotta be, this thing's gotta be close to razor sharp. We'll do the old hairy hand test. And I could tell you based on how it feels, it's definitely gotta be taken off hair. It's It's gotta be. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it, it sure is taking off some hair. It sure is taking off some hair, which is great. That means it's razor sharp. It's not like razor razor like you're going to be shaving with it, but it will take off some hair. And it's clearly cutting through the paper with mostly ease. 
As far as I could tell, this is a really decent knife. I'm very happy I purchased it. It fits so nicely in this cool little sheath. And I don't know, it's just a cool little novelty knife just to have because you can literally fit it anywhere. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little review of this mini meat cleaver knife. It turned out to be a pretty fun little interesting product. Definitely something worth getting for just a couple bucks. I'll pop a link in the description if you want to get your own. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. What are you waiting for? If you're not subscribed to the channel, click the subscribe button right down here. If you want to check out the last video I did, it's up there. And if you want to check out the future playlist and past playlist, the playlist, it's up there. Have a great day, everybody. And as always, don't get shot.